Hey y'all, we are out at One Source Trucks in Burkeville, Virginia. Uh, phone number to call or text is 804-928-9099. Today we are um, going to be taking a look at a 2003 F550 uh, bucket truck. There's going to be all the information in the ad for this um, or in the description um, that will link you to our website which is carnetcars.com where there will be more pictures and details. Um, but the people have spoken and videos are popular and I've been getting so much positive feedback that we're just going to rock out a video. I have um, somebody on the controls who um, this might be the second or third time he's ever operated a bucket truck. So. Good news for y'all is you can see how smooth it is with a very novice operator. Um, bad news is uh, we're not going to have kind of the normal like up, down, articulating features we normally do. But you're going to be able to see what this truck can do even if you don't know what you're doing. So we're going to make it work. So this is a 2003 F550 um, dual rear wheel Versa lift bucket truck. This is a um, insulated boom. It is fully articulating. And it has um, an operating height of just over 41 feet. So it's rated at like 37 and a half feet, which is kind of an unusual, like random number. But um, I'm gonna get up and show the, um, the spec sticker on the boom for that. This is a one owner truck from here in Virginia. Um, it was owned by a municipality, government agency, so you know all the service has been kept up on it. Uh, we did, I think, a little bit of brake work on this one, not a big deal, just kind of routine maintenance. Um, and then after my hydraulic and boom specialist came out and took a look at it and gave it a clean bill of health, we went ahead and decided to do a full cosmetic reconditioning. So we have painted um, the utility body, the wheels. Um, the bumper um, all inside of your um, your back utility bed so we made this truck look as pretty as she operates this truck did uh, just get a current recent Virginia State safety inspection that we did We're gonna do some pictures and stuff with the with the boom completely extended and up in the air and in other positions. Sometimes uh, with the videos to get the boom fully up in the air, we end up losing so much of the truck, um, and it's a little harder to do that. So we're gonna uh, kind of do our best here. I might do another video. Devin, did you go? Devin, did you articulate the other way? Sorry, guys. We're doing our best here. Overall, really super clean truck. Um, I'm gonna get up and show the inside of it. Uh, the seat isn't all torn up. It smells good on the inside. Radio works, AC works. Everything on this truck just seems to work um, just exactly as it should. You do have a tow package on the back as well. Uh, just turned 160,000 miles. So, um, like literally, we, got, we bought it with 159. It just popped 160. You've got all sorts of strobe and operating lights. All of those work. Um, you have uh, ground controls and uh, bucket controls. Those all work. Um, and you also have stabilizers, which is kind of a nice feature. Those are fully hydraulic as well. Um, a lot of times on these uh, lighter duty trucks, we don't, get, um, we don't get stabilizers at all. So the fact that this one has the hydraulic stabilizers is a nice benefit. While he is extending that boom all the way up, I'm gonna do a little more of your details. Hey, Devin, when you get it all the way up, will you hold there for me, please? Hopefully y'all can see that. The sun is super bright out here today. So it is a little hard for me to see my computer screen and even see um, exactly what is in range. We've got really nice compartments. 
all of your latches open and close easily. There's no holes rotten through on your utility compartments. Like I mentioned, we did give this um, a freshen up paint job. We didn't have to do any sort of like real significant body work or anything like that on it. Um, basic, just hand prep and paint. Um, so that's always a good, that's always a good sign. Right. Let's see. I'm gonna step up in here real quick and see if I can get you in on this. Now this tag um, has seen some better days, but it says it's a VST 23601. Um, the rated capacity per platform is 400 pounds. Um, it says the platform height is 35 feet, uh, seven inches. The boom insulated, it says yes. Um, and then there's some other things on here. So maximum vehicle weight for stability, 13,900 pounds. Um, some of these are missing, but um, I'm gonna reach out to VersaLift and see if I can get that information for you. But the important stuff is on there. So like I said, uh, seat in good condition, three person bench, adjustable shoulder belts. I can't read this tag from where I am, but you guys can see what it says. Let's see, I'm gonna hop up in here. Ooh. Radio is on, not sure if you can hear it, but I'm gonna turn it off. But it sounds good. No. Uh, the speakers all sound good. They don't sound like they are worn out or staticky, anything like that. All sorts of nice features. Um, you know, even the um, floor mat is in good shape. You know, it's not all beat up and ripped up. So. Overall, nice condition for a truck that just clocked 160,000 miles. I don't know if you can see that, y'all, but it says 160053. So literally turned from 159 to 160 while we had it. Uh, I'm going to try to smoothly one hand operate it. Um, see if I can get up in here and show Ooh. Oops. the engine. Maybe not. I'm doing my best. Uh, Dev is going to come help me out and get the hood up because uh, I am five feet tall, y'all. Five feet tall. I do my best. Now, ordinarily, I would start this video with a super cold start. Um, but since it's like 80 degrees today, there's no such thing as a super cold start. So I went ahead and just had it run in and uh, the boom and everything. operating and the PTO on from the start of the video because it's all going to sound the same on such a nice one day but we we bought this truck in January December because it's January inspection so we've certainly had it in cold weather um, I hope you can see I turned some of your strobes on so you can see those all were and overall just a really super nice clean truck I'm gonna get back here so you can see um, the boom fully extended um, so the number to call or text, again, is 804-928-9099. The website is carnetcars.com. So look, y'all, I gotta go so far back. 
hope I don't fall down walking backwards. Um, so yeah, it's 804-928-9099, um, carnetcars.com. See, this is why we don't do the whole video um, with the boom up this high because I have to get so far back on the truck. But if you have any questions about this or any other vehicles, um, please reach out, let me know. Um, and I look forward to talking to you soon.